Welcome back guys. In today's episode I would like to address a problem we have within the region. Uh, so uh, we don't have enough electricity. We're missing power and it just keep coming back so I'm just adding uh, some like a random uh, power station. So what I would try to do today in this episode I would like to have something on the uh, the main part of land uh, a solution for it and I was thinking about yes something like that which is nuclear power plant this one is located in Belgium and I would like to use it uh, as a solution for our needs uh, as you see it's based just on the edge of uh, edge of water and uh, in this case uh, it's a river but we have a couple of options in here, but what I would like to do, I would like to use our uh, small piece of land that we have uh, just uh, here on the corner. And we're gonna have uh, this power plant uh, uh, based on workshop uh, solution we have from uh, Steam. And it's uh, one of the Ronix's production, uh, which is, I would say, the best asset you can possibly have. So see you next. So welcome back to the live game. So as you see, we have this uh, place in here. I'm just gonna remove the district. I had it uh, just for as a placeholder, so I'll, at least I know what's happening in here. Uh, before I'm gonna do anything at all, I would like to use uh, a different approach to that. Uh, so what I will try to do, uh, angles, no, I don't need them. What I will try to do, I'm gonna mark this region, uh, this part of it. Uh, we're gonna go there, yes. Uh, I would like to move those rocks. Uh, I quite like the shape of them, so I'm just gonna leave them in here. Uh, and I will tell you why I'm using this road, just like, a, again, can we move those rocks? They are actually quite nice. Uh, I want to use this road to basically mark space we have in here quick auto save and the reason for it the asset it's quite massive and I would like to use as much of land I will and possibly can so what I will do I will try to select all the nodes as we have in here I'm just gonna copy them Look, that's how much space we have in there, but I'm gonna use this flatland, as you see. Uh, select all the nodes and to terrain height, there we go. So I'm gonna use all this flatland uh, to put our plant in place there, but before we do that, let's just see what options we have so if i if you go to find it uh, that's all the buildings you have in there this one will be at the end because it's it's a massive one uh, so that's all the options you have that's the actual two of them that's a pump we're gonna use outside that's the fans, some buildings, some pipes. Why? <laughs> I haven't seen that. Let me just check what's that. <laughs> Cookie monster. Okay. And a couple of pipes on the other side. That's a fan. Uh, 
that's a chimney and that's different color for IC. The only thing is I'm not sure why we seeing this uh, in there. Hmm. I think we're missing something and I think no. Let me just double check that for you. I haven't seen this before. I mean, I've seen all the buildings, but I haven't seen uh, this <laughs> cookie monster before. Give me one second, I'll be back to you. So that was a really good one. <laughs> I managed to remove cookie monster from uh, our all the buildings we have. So that's all the buildings we have. So what I will try to do now is just, I will try to maybe not like mimic all the things you have uh, in this one but what i would try to do i'll try to do something close to that um, building there was uh, as you see one two three four reactors on it so i think i'll try to do something like that so just look uh, let's just look in the space we have and just try to do something similar to that within the space so I will see you in a bit, one second. So as you see, we have all the buildings now with a uh, part of the road connected to them. So that means when we're gonna move them, uh, we're gonna have a connection already made. So it'll be just easy to find a space for them. So first of all, that's our main part. I think I'm gonna use this uh, uh, massive tip so uh, segments I don't need surface I don't need decals the shot that should be good so what we're gonna do we're gonna move you to this tip in there and I would like to have it like that and the road should be something like this. And what I will try to do, I will try to make this connection. So that will be our, uh, I would say like a water source. So water input. And now let's just see how to put those towers. So I would say uh, they should be maybe on this side. I would like to have two of them. So I would like to have one there and one there that will be good point and we can have them connected with road so what i will try to do i'm gonna remove that road have this i don't know that's actually four buildings there so let's just find this like there so that will be our cooling towers they're actually looking quite good inside as well I haven't seen that it's actually cooling tower there which is perfect so we have water in water out so we can have all the rest in here uh, the rest of the building so if you have a look at the uh, the plant itself what you have in here is um, the cooling tower and the reactors are uh, behind so I'm gonna have this main building uh, close to water input and then we can have a look at the rest of them sorry for that 
uh, add the rest of them uh, close there so let's just switch all that and what would you do with the, the building so i would say we can have it moved and we can have maybe like that way uh, I think we can have something like that so let me just check that all of this is just based on the uh, Dole's nuclear uh, power plant but the rest of them it's actually like some of them it's actually vanilla assets so I was thinking this that's road maintenance de depot as a like a main building when you're coming into the the plant and we have some fences around it then you have this which is waste processing complex then we have uh, geothermal power plant and the main reason for it uh, in here we have some steam uh, coming out uh, then we have uh, uh, medical lab we have uh, office we have semiconductor plant so all those buildings they look to me as they should be anywhere close to that we have also like heating plants uh, which looks quite good in here look a lot of pipes and uh, all sort of stuff uh, the one thing uh, I'm probably gonna do uh, with those uh, asset I was thinking about moving them like in here uh, just to see if they're gonna uh, work for me uh, with some steam yeah it's actually looking good and I don't know that was there for a second but I'm gonna move it and I'm gonna do the same thing with you because that will give us yeah some steam in there but this I'm actually gonna use it that's like a power station I have uh, as an asset uh, and I think I'm gonna keep it for now and we're gonna do something with you later on but this place in here uh, I think we should use it for some kind of a transition so I have a couple of uh, substations uh, so let me just see how they look like maybe like in here so that will be one there will be this one and do I have anything more we have those massive lines which I'm trying to use and that was this part I don't need that and that's for the substation I think that will be it and we also have this one that looks really cool so how you can use them to have this massive power going out so I was thinking this part we can have it like there I'm thinking about three of them uh, let me just see if I can uh, copy them uh, no, not with you can I copy use yeah but I will need to uh, put them together there was option in here I think it was like line up So we have to do this one by one, which I'm going to use this fence, but the fence will be, maybe I can keep it, maybe I can keep it. And I want this to be center, like there. The only thing we have to do this like that 
because then we can have those power lines going out from here Something is not right. Why I can? Oh, there we go. So we're gonna have one there. Uh, the only thing we need to move it a bit closer. Can I hide it like that? Yes. And let's just try copy them. And that will give us a nice output and now you can have connection to those so what we're gonna do I would like to have three lines coming out can I move you out yes we're gonna have three lines so I'm gonna use again this line uh, I want this as a center piece so there will be one that will be two that will be three but I would like to have them like that and instead of you we can have this line that just stay with angle Six, six, and five. No, this should be six. <laughs> Let's just stay with six. Yes, that will give us a nice. Uh, I don't like this part. Why you not? So what I will try to do mm, no. Can I have you there? Yes, and see those lines, <laughs> they look quite odd just now, but what I will try to do, I will try to find, no, I don't like it. How to change those lines? Maybe we can do this. Yes. And then can I go down? I don't think I can. Oh, 
all I need is just nice transition which we can probably have something like this and I would like to copy you like there and like there yeah looks all right it's complicated enough and i think that will be a good way to have it and also what we could use is we can use this part somewhere in here like probably like in there as a nice output the only thing we need to use is just now to use um, prop one second and i'll try to find a way okay we have uh, this part already i think the rest we can add a couple of things on the other side so let's just clean up so the first of all we have to remove all of that because we don't need it anymore uh, we just gonna select everything and remove that because that was there just like as a temporary solution then I would like to select all of this uh, for me and let's just go for that see the road we have as an outside that won't be there so I'm gonna copy that and let's just see how we can put it in that narrow space I will say that's pretty close of course they not even but what I will do I will go for ter for the height and I would like to have them at that level that means we have all the buildings on the right level yes that should be good so we can go and exit that so the only thing we have just now we have to remove our road that we have outside we have to remove trees but that's of course coming i think i left anarchy on which is fine that's not a big problem we're gonna get it sorted and we have to clear all of that mess we have around and we need some water of course we get there we get there oh my goodness me what i just removed okay one of the lines Okay. Okay, so let's remove some trees because they all over the place and that's not the case this one and we're gonna remove all the trees from here we're gonna add a couple of bushes but you can have them uh, okay so let me just uh, clear terrain and get back to you so what we have in here again that's all the assets i used some of them as i said before are actually standard assets you can find uh, on the steam workshop what i'm gonna do i'm gonna remove them all gone and the reason for it is 
if you move them to the right spot that's what you can expect there's still a couple of things we need to do in here and I'm gonna do it uh, with you just now so the first of all uh, we need to address security and I think for that uh, this fence it's actually quite good option so what I'm gonna do let's just go to our fence mode and I think that was yes that's oil industry fence and what I will try to do I'm gonna actually extend this and use it like that way uh, one thing how to change direction of it can you actually do it I'm not really sure how to how to change direction but see from the distance you can't tell the difference anyway uh, this one is actually quite right airport fence and I think it's actually better because it's double-sided and it's more secure so ah yes I think we're gonna go for that so if I go for airport fence let's just have a look yes I mean it's saying airport there but from the distance you're not gonna tell what exactly on it but it's just one of those you know keep out stay away and things like that uh, there should be a gate in here as well but we get into that shortly so what I will say we're probably gonna see fans like this and I have this car park there because I was thinking about this car park as a uh, yeah we can have you there and we can have it even to that point there there that just for now yeah that would be okay uh, so let's just find a gate gate there is like a industrial gate yes I want this one and we're gonna have this gate like there and then fence again uh, was this one. Well, I think I'm, I want to move it a bit like that spot yeah that will be much better so that's one thing then we have a gate in here but I think we need connection and connection will be made to this to this road uh, 
the only thing is how we're gonna go over that I'm gonna use this way uh, let's just stay with angle there there and there of course they're not gonna stay like that uh, why there is no okay sorry what we will do gonna move you we're gonna make change to bridge and those two nodes gonna go up to at least that height and of course uh, they won't stay there because what we need to do we need to move it slightly same with you so it's a nice gentle slope and I think we can use this tool okay so now if that's the case how are we gonna go to our uh, power plant uh, not this one so I think I would like to follow terrain uh, so what we could do we can go straight like that and then let's just stay with the terrain roughly as we have it in there so it's like you know old road in the distance and you have a motorway next as a next step but we're not gonna use it now we're just gonna go the old way and I would like to go in there and here I would like to go next to our coastline yes and a nice connection there uh, I don't like this connection but we're gonna fix it using our magic move it tool there we go so now all we need to do we need to change our road to this one okay that's much nicer yes that will be good option so that's our car park you can have like a slight fence around it something simple like a park fence And I think I'm gonna use move it to have it connected there. Can you hear it? Listen closely. Yeah, that's that's it's actually alright. Pop soda refreshment. And the only thing Pop here Belch the best. we're gonna do this. So we can have this road. We can have no buses uh, no taxis delivery and that's it at least they don't need to worry about eating a whole chicken know that could be you know like a entrance 
No, they won't be won't be cars like that. It's just like see the ones that spawned recently. They coming in here. Where are you? Camper <laughs> van. Okay, you can't go in there. I know it's like a tourist attraction, uh, but you can't go in there. The only way you can go in there is on foot, uh, and that will be like restricted. So let's just uh, finish off our fans. I think I want to go uh, with angle, yes. I want to go there. Let's just switch off the angle for now. But what I would say, you can have people coming there as well. So we're gonna have you there. And in here, you can have people. Coming there either. It's not like a, a place for you to go and just, you know, Put your uh, blanket and just relax. I don't think that's the, that's the place. Okay, so a couple of things we need to do in here. I will say we need to use oh, the rock tool, rock tool, rock tool. This one, no, this one, yes. So we're gonna use this tool and we're gonna add couple of things so that's our construction site so we're gonna have a fence around this as well they actually adding you know next part of it then we're gonna have this part like this And I will say around the actual reactors, you should have a lot of concrete and no trees. Still have a couple of them, but they will be all removed. So no trees. That all should be concrete in case of any leaks at all. The other thing that's a massive construction, so they're quite heavy, so there shouldn't be any... Same for those ones. I mean, you can have something massive like those chimneys sitting on the ground. They should be like based on concrete. concrete. Mm, there we go. And maybe here as well, some kind of a connection between them. And how to remove trees. Uh, yeah, with this tool. That was just by accident, so we're gonna remove some of them. And I think we need to clean that as well. So let's just do our fence in here. Because again, that's something you can expect that the car park you're gonna leave your car will be secure. 
and same in here I will say there there and there so there is no access I mean it's a police station of course but at the same time it just looks like the place you should check in that's the office you should go so I will say all of that together uh, there will be some movement there so it's not like a uh, nothing happening there and I think we need to do couple of some couple of things on the on the front uh, but just for now I will say uh, you can expect something like that so do you have water that's like a uh, water coming in so it's like intake uh, cold water coming in that's uh, all those reactors uh, creating uh, tons and tons of steam uh, and the generators uh, working there and of course deep in the ground and then the hot water you can't just dump it into the water that's just like uh, how you could say a heat pollution so you can't do that and with all of this it's out uh, through those uh, massive uh, cooling chimneys um, and it's just steam nothing nothing more just clean clean steam uh, what I also did I have this part in here so as you can expect there will be a lot of uh, output uh, to the main cities we have in here I actually want to do something let just let just grab one thing uh, I have this uh, and I think I'm gonna use it in here. Can I do that? Yeah, I can do that. The only thing we need to do, we just need to lower this down. Uh, that should be only two notes. And the reason for it is just we need to have it somehow secure like that and can I copy you in yes so it will be like a steps I will say and I can uh, lower you down like that yes now that should be that should be okay and all the power from those massive generators it's going out so we're gonna have one of them coming here and I show you just for now I will have this intake like let's just say there because the annoying thing is just this end line so that's like a uh, intake for power and we should have this uh, I'm lost sorry uh, I'm gonna have this connected to the our cities in there but for now I'm just gonna leave it as it is uh, and that's us for today so I hope you're gonna enjoy it. Uh, I quite like this build. There will be probably a couple of things we need to do, maybe clean some um, terrain around this, uh, don't, so it's not so steep like in these places, but that's something I can do uh, out of the camera because that's just, you know, nothing, nothing major to do. But I would say it's looking quite good and we have tons and tons of power. Uh, show you we have like 8000 megawatts of power which is that's exactly what what you can expect to have from uh, from this uh, source so that means I can remove everything else we have in here producing power like all the things that I put somewhere um, the one thing can I do uh, can I do no parking Probably I can. 
that will take all the cars out of our I mean a couple of them are actually good you know that could be employees uh, I'm treat this as, a, as an office uh, so you can have a couple of employees coming in here which is fine that's that's fair enough you can you can expect that so um, thank you so much for watching I will see you in next episode uh, of uh, our region uh, but that uh, small build will be as a separate um, uh, on my channel so hope you're gonna like it and I'll show you uh, a quick overview thank you so much bye bye